Clothing, baby and pet supplies, hygiene and cleaning kits, appliances, mattresses, food and drink, and even mold remediation kits. It's all in a warehouse to help San Diegans impacted by the January 22nd floods. The one-stop shop is now open to help victims replace some of the things they lost. And my co-anchor, Wally Aliu, got a tour of the warehouse earlier today and takes us inside. You got like six to eight feet of water. They don't have anything from a picture frame to a pair of shoes. So what we did was make sure we got shoes for him, shoes for her. All for free. All for free. And who's yeah. paying for it? Like where does this, where's the funding? So um, most of the funding will come from like private donors in certain sectors that, um, that come in as partnerships. And then as well as most of our volunteers are just, it's just free. Of course, we have plenty of water that we bring out to a lot of the hotels. Right now we have 66 hotels that have evacuated families in them. And then certain families that are going into their home immediately, they would let us know the size of mattresses. So this whole wall right here, and there's some back here, we have a, a little over 300 mattresses in the building at, as of right now. While they're in hotels, we kind of eliminate what we can give them only because they're in such small spaces. But if they ask for extra blankets, we get them blankets. If they get, um, if they're in the process of demolition, we get them sinks. And so, as you can see over here, we have anything from your single sinks, if they want to separate their sinks, or your double sinks. A lot of the homes are older, so they had the porcelain sinks that we noticed that were cracking. A few of them are, you know, staying in their garage or got one room fully repaired. We make sure that we have a way for them to cook barbecues. We have cots. We have sleeping bags, air mattresses, inflatable air pads. So all this stuff would go as an immediate need. This to is the so families. exciting because I have been talking with these families for the last couple months and they've lost everything and they're waiting on miracles to replenish everything they've lost and this is essentially a miracle for them. It, it will be, yeah. And, I, and it has been really a really good task. We've met a lot of families in need and so when we're able to talk to them and they're like, well, I immediately need you know, something to sleep off the ground and something to cook off of. And we're like, hold on and we go get that for them. So it makes it nice for us to have it right here in this facility that the county was so nice to you know, give to us to use. The warehouse is in an undisclosed location. Flood victims should reach out to their case manager for any of these items.